In tonight's Healthier Me, opioid addiction is skyrocketing. And while the U.S., rather the use of medications to prevent overdose and relapse has increased, not all young patients are getting treatment. A new study from Boston University looked at over 20,000 13 to 25 year olds diagnosed with opioid use disorder. About a quarter were prescribed one of two drugs, buprenorphine or naltrexone as part of their treatment. But researchers found younger people, females and minorities were less likely to receive these medications. Early intervention for opioid addiction has been shown to reduce the risk of premature death and lifelong harm. A different study suggests that going easy on fried potatoes could give you a longer life. The study says people could double their risk of dying early if they eat fried potatoes two of three times a week. Scientists in Italy came to that conclusion after tracking more than 4,000 people over eight years. But they say the study is observational, meaning it didn't prove that fried potatoes can cause an early death. The scientists say that other factors should be in play, including obesity and sedentary lifestyle. The U.S. National Potato Council says the study has no relevance to the general population. Ah, be too bad to put down those fries, huh? I'm going to risk it. <laughs> yeah. After winning his third Stanley Cup, Moorhead's own Matt Cullen visited the area today. And the burning question on the minds of many fans is, is this the end? Details to come later in sports. Up next, so many of us use Google when we want to find something online. Unfortunately, it's being used the wrong way. What Google's doing to battle hate content.